when I was kind of starting out in the film industry, the people I loved hearing from were actual kind of practitioners and people who were working in the industry, like guests who have achieved something, who were in the film industry then and there. It's not just these huge blockbuster movies where people thought, well, I couldn't be a part of that. No, there are these fantastic movies too and amazing British movies that are made very simply that you can make them, that you can act in them, that you can design them, that you can edit them. You can make the movie entirely on your own. I think a lot of people who aren't in it, they see like the glamour of it and they're like, ooh, it's like a glamorous career. It's not, but they think, oh, it's like not for the likes of us. And that's such a damaging attitude to have. I never had like mass amounts of cash to be able to do whatever I wanted and therefore I could get into the film industry. I never had a family member within the film industry who helped me. So it's really just about sheer determination and passion and everyone can have that. Making a film is not a closed uh, operation. There are lots of jobs on offer and you know, there's a lot of talent in the, in the north of England of course. Various programs that um, Interfilm and the BFI also offer in, in this area uh, are really valuable to, to, to foster that that kind of thought that you can work in film. I think a lot of people think you need to rush off to London to, to uh, get a career in film. I think that's becoming less and less true. You know, there's nothing to hold you back here. I'm really hoping the City of Culture will, will bring that uh, and shed some light on it and hopefully um, set a precedent for kids who are maybe involved in, in into film to, you know, to, to go on and, and, and follow in that.